Today we're going to cover automatic route tracking in your Pokemon Nuzlocke using Pokelink. By now you've probably already heard of Pokelink. If not, check it out in the video card at the top here and get on it. It's an awesome tool for streamers and content creators to make your lives 100 times easier. Route tracking is key in Nuzlocke since it's part of the core rule set, right? But keeping track of it in a spreadsheet, a text file or use an app on your phone is just so cumbersome. So why not make it automatic? Pokelink does that for you. So now we're going to open up Pokelink and create a new session and go through this whole process end to end. So let's create a new session called Route Tracking Demo. And then we'll quickly go to Gen 7, make sure Citra is open. Go to Gen 7, hit Ultra Sun and confirm. Now it's going to boot up a connector that goes to Citra and it's done. Now we're going to type in my username port and click on Create Session. Now you see it's already picked up all my Pokemon, right? So I'm going to go in and we see we've only got Gabite here, right? It's already mapped in the app. So now we look at Route Tracker and we can see the only Route 5 is done. It's automatically tracked from the Gabite. So it already knows that you've been to Route 5 and caught from Route 5. So now let's check this mountain. So let's go into the grass. Now I have got Master Balls for this demo just to make it quick and easier, right? So let's go to our bag quickly. Let's go down to Poke Master Ball. There we go. And let's throw the Master Ball. Now, you'll see that it's still greyed out, all right? So currently, there's nothing checked. There's no uh, Beldum in there. So we'll name that Dum Dum. And it's added to the part automatically. It's already got the root on it down below. You can do that by going to the cog down the bottom and clicking the location met. So that, that now knows where the location was of that Pokemon. And we have the route tracker. We search for mount and already tracked. That is how easy automatic route tracking is with Pokelink. So what are you doing it manually for? I'll see you in the Discord in a bit.